So welcome back to Tough Love Fishing, everybody. I'm Jonah. I'm here with Billy right now. And we are in Pisgah National Forest, North Carolina. We came down to visit our cousins, and they showed us around. They gave us the inside scoop on all of the greatest creeks to fish out of. We are here high in the mountains. My God. Look how beautiful this location is. Crystal clear water. Look at the moss on the rocks. I'm, I'm walking on them. In awe of the gorgeous beauty I'm surrounded by. Look at the moss. It's almost fluorescent. My God. The beautiful rocks. I, I, I was in heaven. I came upon this hole. Jonah, remember? You were behind me. And yeah. I was... I, I, I had full confidence at this point. I stroll over to this... Everything was so brand little new. Little fall. Yeah, everything's new. I, I see this beautiful little waterfall. This whole... I, I felt real confident. There's got to be a really? trout in there. A trout in there's got to be one. And then, boom! I got one. One on the Hooked line. It. How does it feel, Jonah, to not catch one? And I'm catching them. Well, you know, it's more so luck of the draw, right? Shush, enough with that. Oh. It's about skill. It's oh. about talent. It's about using the right lure at the right time. And I was using a little Rapala. Oh, right that fish is not even that much bigger than the Rapala. And right. yet I was catching a gorgeous little native rainbow. Native rainbow. Beautiful trout. High in the mountains. There you are. Yeah, there I am. <sighs> Look at that fish. <sighs> Look at the gorgeous location. Oh my god. Great release there, Bill. Good one. I could totally release that better than you. But you didn't. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. All right. I didn't so catch a fish. here you're getting your backpack, you're getting your things. There I am actually fishing. Yeah, actually catching fish. I didn't catch fish the first day. Well, they're not supposed to know of that at this point, Jonah. All right. You're supposed to keep them in suspense. Now every time they see you. Wearing your GoPro, well, I guess they might not know, unless you can tell the difference between our rods, but I was the man that day, okay? I caught the fish. Thanks for revealing that, Jonah. I'm glad that the audience knows that now. You're always really good at thinking. Okay. See, like, why didn't I catch a fish here? I casted it in at the right place. Yeah, and you were using a decent lure. You're using a little soft I'm plastic using... grub, little neon chartreuse. Oh. Chartreuse, a little neon grub. Gets the job done a lot of the freaking times. Isn't that right, Jonah? Exactly. And mm -hmm. how that tail wiggles behind the grub. Oh, it swims beautifully in the water. Shit. The trout just can't help themselves right here. You should be catching one. You should. But unfortunately, you're not. Yeah, I'm I already caught bored. A fish. I'm bored with you right now. Well, can we move on to me? But look at the scenery, though, right? Let's move That's on. That's good to... scenery. Well, yeah, right? I I do every I want everyone to really be able to because Jonah did do a good job of wearing his GoPro. Yeah, he wasn't I'm... wearing waders. See him hopping along the rocks like a fool. Yeah, when to... you go to these locations, <laughs> you have to wear waders. Like I'm sorry, there's no uh, if ands or buts. You've I know, got... but you can still fish though. You've you know, got I these... was still fishing. You know. With a rod in my hand, casting it yeah, in the water. You could teach a monkey how to fish. It's whether you're doing it right or not. All right? I had to... Look at me. Look at me. I, yeah. Oh, I'm so pathetic. Grabbing onto the water but for balance. But at least I'm prepared. Oh. At least I'm prepared, Jonah. See, I'm standing in the water. I had been already seeing trout following my lure yeah. at this point. And I was like, oh, I felt super confident. And then right around now. Oh, uh, I got him. See him jump out of the water? That's what I'm talking about. Beautiful freaking rainbow and trout. Look, look at or it. no, this is a brown. This is a wild brown. So now we're on species number two. I was a, a wild rainbow before. Now I've got a wild brown. Oh, man. Look at it wiggling in the net. Now he had come off. Right when I put him in the net, he came off. And then it look, got you're, hooked you're on stabbing, his tail. You're stabbing the poor fish. It's screaming right now. You just can't hear it because we don't on, speak buddy. fish. Look. Oh, ah! You're hurting it. No. I'm, I took good care of him. 
Uh, it was so frustrating when when the when the hooks get caught in the net, but That's I got it out and then right there, baby. Yeah. All right there. See, I'm fully prepared. That is a beautiful wild brown. Wow. The patterns and the spots on the fish. The colors. The, the colors. The dots. This is what I came for. The red. This is what I caught in it. This is just ridiculous. Oh, yeah. It's literally heaven on earth. I'm oh, yeah. Right it's literally heaven on earth. All right, buddy. You did a great job today. I'm going after my little Rapala. Now the release. Here we go. Oh. Ready? And go. boom. Under the rocks he goes. Man. Look at the gorgeous scenery. People, do you realize? Do you understand? Can you appreciate that? Can you appreciate that? I appreciate it. And I appreciate even watching when Jonah's fishing, even though he's not catching fish, because I'm looking at beauty. I'm looking at a gorgeous. <laughs> Destination. I just want to fish so bad. We arrived. I arrived. Oh. I came. I saw. I caught. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> I didn't catch a fish. Not look. The... I should have caught one. You should have. Look at your. You're jerking it just right. <laughs> You got that jerk bait going on. Wow. It should have. It should have been game on right there. It should have been game on. It should have been. He went up to the road. Oh man. You know there had to have been a fish in there. At least looking at it. Maybe it just wasn't the right color at the right time. It's amazing, people, how fish are can be very, very finicky. They're so picky. They can be just like you know. I'm gonna be yeah. making my way I don't the want that, that one. one. And then they'll see a different color. Like because switching, for, for instance, speed, switching from a, a gold spinner to a silver spinner. Right. It could be night and day. Oh, damn. Right. It all just depends at times. It does. You ever wonder, like, why is it? Because it's not just like one fish that might like gold and another fish that might like silver. It's a lot of times like, they're all on the same page. They're all on the same page. And 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 you can be fishing and nothing will be happening for hours. Right? Three hours pass, nothing. And then all of a sudden it's, Bam! It, yeah, it's just Boom! you're they're just biting. getting slammed right and left. Look. Out of nowhere. Oh no, you no I am not, I don't think I catch anything out of this hole. Even though Look I at felt the dot, really though. confident about Look it. Look at the dot on the camera though. Look at the dot. Right, thanks for pointing that out. Thank you. Now I'm standing far back. I cast in. I'm feeling real confident and then slam, I got a hit. Oh yeah, that's a fish. Look at him jump. That's a fish. It's almost like a lagoon. I I honestly so when I beautiful. saw it, I just wanted to just take off my clothes and bathe in that water jump right in look at it i feel like a mermaid could emerge from that the home. bottom of the creek and just come in come Join in me. swim with me here we are another wild rainbow trout oh man what a gorgeous fish that beautiful that pink wild color wild going wild down his middle you ever look at a fish so good that you just want to hold it and just bite right into yes, it. Yes, I honestly, I, I feel that way watching it right now. Like, I want to bite that All right, fish. now I do an underwater release, but this fish, man, he was comfortable in my net. He didn't want to leave. Man, I want to bite that fish. You want to have it for dinner? I want to bite that fish. You want to bite it? Come on, buddy. You want to sink your teeth right into it. I just love, that. I just love looking at them. I love trout people. He didn't want to go. I could oh, look he at the to fish. Stay with me. Look at me. I'm, I'm like forcing him out. Like, come on, let's go. You can go. Yeah, you were really trying to get him out. But he, he didn't want to. He didn't no. want to leave. There he goes. Finally, there you go.
Here I am switching up to the lore that Billy was using since it's been about two hours at this point of catching jack squat. I haven't caught anything. But this hole in particular was one of the best holes on the stretch. It was, and you felt really confident about it. I think the deepest part in this hole is about seven feet at least. Yeah, there should there should be a mountain monster in there. And I was, yeah, I was feeling super confident casting it in. <clears throat> you had a good cast on that one. I saw it land way out. Look at the gorgeous trees in the background above your hairy arm. Yeah. Your, arm, at, your uh, arms are so white. They're and so hairy. Mm. Your arms just are in the way. I want to see the river and I want to see the trees. I don't want to see your veiny, pale arms. I know. My, ooh, ooh. What was that, Jonah? That was a bite. Oh, close. It, it was a bite. Close, but no cigar. That was a big bite. All right, you're going to cast again. I'm already bored. Well, hold on. Okay, eventually, all right, fine, eventually, fine. Gosh, come on, give me a chance. Man up. Eventually, the trout, I get another bite, and the trout actually jumps out of the water. Before, Hopefully we can see it. Maybe. Maybe if your freckly white arms are out of the way. My arms are clearer than the water. <laughs> Maybe you can get it right. You're jerking it just right. I'm jerking it. And then... Oh! oh I saw it. I did see, see the little over... fin. I did see it peek over your pale Damn. arm. Yeah. It... Dang, that right. was a close call. I mean, I wish right I could tan. All right, I'm ready to move on. Even though I can look at that. I want, I want a picture of that in my house so I can look at that. Frame it right over the yeah. living room couch. Yeah. People, this day that, that we were fishing was such a gorgeous day. And one of the most gorgeous locations that you could possibly yeah. fish. Yeah, and at this point, I was drooling. Oh, I was like, I had just gotten two bites at this point. You were salivating. You felt real confident at this point that you were going to catch a trout. My slime just dripping into the little ponds next to the creek amongst the rocks. Hmm, that's interesting. That's a visual. That's a good visual there. Oh. Thanks for describing that to us in great detail you're so descriptive with your words Jonah. all right i'm bored now can we start seeing me because i good cast good cast even though you don't have much line on your on your reel yeah that's another topic it's another one of jonah's many i was vastly unprepared this day wasn't you I? were you didn't, I didn't wear have your waiters water <laughs> yes dude didn't he have... didn't bring any water <laughs> i didn't have some Block. Yeah, you didn't wear your waders, and you also didn't bring the camera. All right, finally, you, it's back you to happy me. Now? I'm me and my horrible GoPro skills, but at least I'm doing something right here. I'm catching fish. I got one on the line. You might not see it at the moment, but I got one. I had to dangle him in the air, get him over the rocks, and then safely into the net. Now this rainbow, this native rainbow, has some of the most beautiful colors and patterns. It I does. wish I could have gotten a picture. Can you, can you people see this? Look at the beautiful spots and patterns. I can't. If I could get my hand out of this dang pliers, all right. Look at me, my fat fingers. Get it out already, please. All right, now, people, look. Oh, oh my gosh. Now this trout was so s slick, he just ends up swimming right through my net here. I knew it wasn't even a... I was just trying to catch my breath, and, and boom, he's gone. Yeah. Too bad we couldn't get in on the water. People, release. it's been real. Please stay tuned. We're going to have more content, two and part two and three of Pisgah National Forest. Coming up. And if you would like, subscribe to the channel and check out another one of our videos in the top left corner. Thank you so much. Until next time, I'll see you on the other side of the creek.